Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Mint Smiles, and today I'm going to be doing an amiibo scan. I'm going to be going over what every amiibo drops, and I'm going to be going over some of my favorites first. I got them for Christmas, I made an announcement video, and I'm not sure what the odds are on most of these, but we're going to scan them, starting from which ones I think are most interesting and that I'm most excited for. So first what you need to do is find a nice flat area or else you're going to drop stuff because amiibos drop chests with other stuff in it. So right here is a nice flat area. To use the amiibos you'll need to go to system, options, and change this to use amiibo. Then it, it will then be a room. So equip it and you'll have this little circle thing here. There's no way to bring it close to you. At first, the one I'm most excited about, I'm not sure if it'll work here, but we might have to try somewhere else, is Wolf Link. This is obviously the Wolf Link amiibo, as it's the only one with Link with Wolf. You need to grab your card and use this part of it. Like, it might just work in the center, but you have to press it onto the joystick. And then he'll materialize from this guy. So put that in these tile. So now we have Wolf Link. You can spawn him as many times as you want any day, all the time, as long as you have the amiibo card. He will disappear if you go too far away from him, and you can see his life gauge. Kit. You can feed him raw meat and stuff. I've tried, he won't eat apples. <laughs> and he's magical, he can walk up walls. <laughs> he will stay with you. And another one that I was most excited about was Epona, but most I got a pack of 24 cards. Most of them will randomly spawn an opponent, so now I have two at the stable. But next up, we have the champions cards. So I'm not sure what the drop weights are, but so far I have scanned all of them once yesterday. Well, not really, it's like one in the morning. But. <laughs> I have already gotten the Meadows Helm, and this is what it looks like. It's just a giant bird head, a little more complicated than him, and you have glowing eyes, and you can see how long Link's hair really is. But, yeah, it's pretty cool you have a, not a very high chance, but a chance to get them each Divine Beast Helm from the amiibo cards. You can scan all of these once a day and yeah. And nobody's entirely sure what the percentage is except maybe the creators of the amiibo, but moving on. Now we're going to skin. So we'll start off with Mifa. Make sure you equip your amiibo. I've tried putting them on quite a few times. You can only use the original controllers. Pro doesn't work, sadly, so. My table's a mess from Christmas, but it's fine. <laughs> so then we're going to start off with Mifa. making sense as Mifa's Azora, it will drop some fish and a chest. And the 
most common item is the silver scale spear. You most likely get a Zora weapon or the or the helm. You get armor burgi, volt fin trout. <laughs> okay, I don't want to keep going this. Here's a quick hat. Switch to Magnesis, you can just get rid of the ones that you don't have enough room for, or they're not good enough. And the Sizzle Fin, Shroud, Mighty Porgy, Hyrobass, and Bolt Fin. And you can get all ra all different ranges of fish. Sorry, I'm going to have to release this video without reusing anything, because you can only scan them once a day. So, there you go. But next up, we have... Herbosa. We have Herbosa card. Okay, I'm just not even going to talk about this because there's so many things that are not correct about this card, but whatever. <laughs> it's fine. Make sure you. Make sure you have it ready and keep it away from the ledge or else you're going to have to fall down a cliff. And we're going to scan the Urbosa card. As you can see, Urbosa dropped lots of meat. Which doesn't really make much sense, but... And you get the Moonlight Skimmer or the Skimmer of the Seven. You must likely get the common items of what the champion's main weapons are or their races weapons I suppose you would call them. Anyway, put that in the use pile. And moving on, next up we have Revolin. If I'm correct, the champion's amiibos have no chance of spawning a Pona. But next we're going to scan Revali. Ravali dropped some Hydramons, Chickaloo Tree Nuts, Spicy Peppers, and Acorns. And you will most likely get a Falcon Bow or a Great Eagle Bow if you're lucky. But I need that for this is a quick shot because I'm going to do the archery. Get rid of these. But up last, and to me, the least, we have Daruk's Amiibo Bill card. It's not very flattering, but oh well. <laughs> Make sure you have it open. I keep doing this, forgetting to. And Daruk dropped a lot of ores, salts, and a stone smasher. I prefer to just not even have that because I am horrible at fighting with two handed weapons, so. Better look next time, I guess. Okay. So now we are going to start on the normal amiibos, I guess you could call them. Anyway, but we're going to do all the rest of them now. Just a quick tip, if you want a chance of getting a Pona out of any of these amiibos, make sure it's somewhere that horses can spawn. Your horses cannot go to the desert or the elven regions. I have two opponents so far. You, they spawn with max bond, five star strength, speed, stamina, and gentle. She also has a 
a very nice custom saddle and bridle. Hello. Yes. Yes, hello. Now, but you do not need to bond with her at all when you get her. And you can have up to five of them at the stable. Hello. I'm give her a nap real quick. Don't know how many apples. I'll give her a carrot then. Some horses will just snatch food out of your hand if you're close enough to them. Like this. Good girl. But she looks pretty cool. Sadly though, you can't dye her mane or change her tack as the lady at Troths says she's too beautiful or something and doesn't want to mess it up. She's a very fancy person. Very good for archery. Well, that really depends on if you're good at archery or not. But moving on, let's go start scanning some amigos. So up first, we have this one. This is the first one that got me Epona. I'm not sure if there's specific stats on different cards or drop rates, but spawn rates, I suppose they call them. Mix. This one card will drop. One hydromelon, one acorn, one wildberry, one apple, one spicy pepper, and two palm fruits. It'll also drop a chest which often contains arrows, as Link is seen with a bow. Moving on, we have this one. Link in his fighting stance, I guess. This card will drop a lot of boxes. Three, I'll drop three boxes, probably just better to use a bomb. There's a horrible drift on this. Um, I'll drop some arrows and some acorns, and you get a bundle of five of any elemental arrow from inside. The boxes contain rupees and more arrows. So this is the archery-ish kind of one. It all varies what they drop, but yeah, that one always drops boxes. The Types of arrows are randomized, and the amount of rupees is 2. Next, we have the Ganondorf one. This, though it seems like it'd be a special card, is actually pretty normal. It only drops a few barrels, which are filled with rupees and arrows, and an apple and a chest. All of these come with a chest and some drop loot. Lionel Guts. This highly sought after ingredient can only be obtained for an Lionel. It pulses with the vitality of Lionel, a strength that makes it invaluable as an ingredient for elixirs. That is a very good find, and amiibos are very helpful if you're in a tight spot and need food or anything. Just make sure you find a safe spot so they don't die when you're trying to summon it. <clears throat> I'm sorry, my voice is bad. Next, we have Dodging Link. Link has decided to come live in a hay shelter because the drift on the Joy Cons is very bad, and I mostly use the Pro Controller. Dodging Link will drop two Mighty Bananas, a chest, Ooh. a Royal Shield, which is very, very interesting. 55, oh my god. A royal shield, which I assume is one of the rarer drops. Some mighty bananas, apples, acorns, tree nuts, and such. Probably get rid of your shield after that. Moving on. Next up, we have 
Wind Waker, I believe. I don't know. Link with a Flute. I'm not very good at the games. At the different games or anything. Breath of the Wild's the only one I've ever played. I've only watched 30 videos. Little tiny baby Link jumping or something. I don't know, looking majestical. Which little tiny baby Link looking majestical will drop a lot of fish and a chest. Got five more bomb arrows. All these fish. But that is probably all I have enough time for today. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. It always helps. And tell me what you'd like to see in future videos down below. Anyway, I'll do a part two with all the rest of the Amiibos. Bye.